بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس دس از دا سیکنڈ لیکچر آف گریڈ فائیو یونٹ نمبر ون انویسٹیگیٹنگ دی پلانٹ گروتھ اینڈ آئی ایم یور سائنس ٹیچر سدرا ظفر ٹوڈے وی اسٹڈی اباؤٹ دا جرمینیشن ان دس لیکچر وی ول اسٹڈی وٹ از جرمینیشن وٹ آر دا ریکوائرمنٹس فار دا جرمینیشن اینڈ ہاؤ ڈز اٹ اکرس Germination is the process by which a seed starts to grow. And for the growth of the seed, there are the three factors which are very important for the germination. The first one is water. It helps the seed to swell up so the embryo can start to grow. The second factor is warmth. It speeds up the germination. The third factor is air. It releases energy for the embryo to germinate. These are the three factors. When the seed absorbs water, this is the seed and this is the seed coat. When this seed absorbs light or warmth from the sun, water, it cracks. The seed coat is cracked and the little baby plant which is also known as embryo and has been shown in the green color starts to grow once the seed coat opens the seed will consume food from the food store and grows into the plant here is a block diagram for the complete process of the germination the seed receives warmth oxygen means air and water and results into the growing plant the complete process of the germination consists of the five steps number 1 absorption of water number 2 splitting of seed coat number 3 growth of the root number 4 growth of the shoot number 5 growth of the tiny leaves This is a complete picture of the germination which shows the complete steps of the germination. You can see this is the seed. It starts to absorb the water and it is swelled. And this swellation results into the crack of the seed coat and the little embryo baby plant starts to grow. When this baby plant means embryo receives sunlight it breaks or splits into the two parts the first part is root which grows downward and it receives more water from the soil and the second part is the shoot which grows upward these are the two parts of the embryo the root downward and the shoot upward and the fifth step is when the tiny leaf starts to grow on the shoot this is the complete picture of the germination i hope you understand it and there is a task for you rewrite the complete lecture and also draw the diagrams for the germination in the next lecture we will do or discuss an activity to observe the germination in home garden I hope you understand this lesson if you have any question regarding to this lesson you may ask on my number